Now, have you ever heard the expression, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, my man? Yeah. Uh, what happens in Vegas stays on your crotch cord. Hey, man. Hey, of course now, I've on. heard that. Come on now. I got cream. And you said you wouldn't tell nobody about that. You ain't my friend. Well, hey, don't be stingy with that when you're using that. You know, you just uh, <laughs> you spread it all around. Oh, you I'm need a little tired bit. of you complaining about your crotch. You need a little cream there? Okay. All right. All right. Let's leave my crotch alone and get out of this because we've got a movie to talk about. Oh, I will. <laughs> so we're talking about what happens in Vegas. All the, right. The movie. Let's talk about it. All right. So Who's in this movie, Corey? Well, we have Cameron Diaz. Cameron Diaz? Well, yeah. well, that's that chick who's in uh, The Mask, right? Uh, yeah, she need a mask these days. Oh, but that, no. No she's, no, she's all right, man. She's she's a good-looking girl. She's very beautiful. She's in this movie along with your friend, Ashton Kutcher. No! Not yes. that son of a bitch, Ashton Kutcher. Coochie coochie. Oh, I hate that dude. Why do you hate Ashton Always Kutcher, Always smiling, man? punking people, trying to be funny. He ain't funny, Corey. I'm funny. He sucks, dude. All right? Just don't, don't forget that. You don't hate him because he's beautiful, man. I see the jealousy on your oh, part. No, wanna, come on. I want I want to beat him up like that dude in Fight Club. I just, I just, wanna, I just, I just want to destroy something beautiful. <laughs> No, don't like him because he's beautiful. All right, Ugh. man. So we got those two guys in the movie, and it's kind of a dumb movie, but I kind of like the hook in this movie. Uh, 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 what's the hook? Was Cameron Diaz getting naked? Man, we don't get that kind of hook in there. That'd be Damn a hell of a Corey. hook. No, you know, it, ain't, it don't get that good. No, uh, I'm sorry. PG thirteen. Uh, PG thirteen. Oh my god, was it prom night two? <laughs> so the hook here is that. All right, we have Cameron Diaz and Ashton Kutcher who both live in New York, and they're going through some real traumatizing, life-changing experience. Ashton, oh, really? Yeah. Well, they're good-looking, and that, that sucks in the, the modern I know. world? Yeah, you look at these people, you're thinking, what kind of trouble could they have? Is this a Twilight Zone episode? Yeah, What's going be- on? Yeah, be- beautiful-looking, lovely white people. And <laughs> <laughs> beautiful people don't have problems, Corey. Exactly. What are, they, what are they complaining about? Nothing's wrong with their life. Sons of bitches. They can get laid anytime they want to. It's me. <laughs> don't me rem- I- hey, don't remind me. <laughs> take pity on me so they the, well in this movie because it is a movie that being a movie they are having problems yeah Ashton Kutcher first of all works for his father his father even comes in and says man you a sorry son of a bitch Holy. even as your father I gotta fire you <laughs> it sounds like your dad I, uh, I wish my dad had fired me from uh, when I was working with him look dad I can only I can only pick up the trash for so long pops <laughs> yeah, down, teach me it? something else <laughs> father and son garbage man is that what we yes. are my father down there on the ground this is how you pick up trash boy like this <laughs> yeah, you, you know, don't know how to pick up trash live with the legs stupid <laughs> <laughs> not not what you need. <laughs> so now, so yeah, he gets fired by his dad, and Cameron Diaz, she goes through a pretty bad uh, a pretty bad breakup. I think they're about to have some kind of anniversary party or something. She's having a surprise party for him. Mm-hmm. He doesn't know people are around. Comes in, breaks up with her while all her friends are hiding behind furniture, listening, probably <laughs> laughing at her <laughs> dumb ass. That's what she gets for being in those dumb ass Charlie's Angels movies. Oh, come on the now, dumb broad. <laughs> What'd you say? And for nothing else, I'm leaving your ass. Can't take that shit. I can't watch these goddamn DVDs. You keep popping in here every time your friends show up. Get the hell out of my house. What'd you say? Might as well turn around and fart in his face. I can't. <laughs> yeah. Can't stay with you. <laughs> no, sh- no, sh- no. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> so. So they they both decide to uh, uh, drink their woes away by going to Las Vegas. Now they don't know that the other is gone. They just when they get there, mm-hmm. they meet up, and it's by accident. They ru- that's a mix up in the room. Oh. They end up in the same room. It's it's Ashton Kutcher and his buddy played by Rob Corddry, his mm-hmm. his lawyer and drinking pal, and and, and uh, Cameron Diaz with uh, with I think this girl name is Lake Bell, her her mm-hmm. girlfriend. So they get there. And they and they settled the, the whole thing with the room, but then Ashton Kutcher is looking at them and is like, "Oh, these two fine ass girls right here, man! Hey, wait a minute, y'all ain't gotta go yet." Oh no, ladies! Yeah. First we'll hit the slots, then we'll hit the sluts. Yes. Ooh. Well, you you know how to get the ladies yeah. with the lines, don't you? You a real Woo. you a real gentleman. Works every time. Yeah, I'm sure it does. <laughs> so he, he he tells them he convinces them to stay, and of course. They start talking about what each other went through. They're drinking. They, they get drunk. They start acting crazy. Mm-hmm. They wake up in the morning. And they, they wake up in the morning. And, and they're fat chicks. <laughs> fat chicks in the bed. Is that what happens? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's no. A, yeah, Cameron Diaz is a dude. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's a horror film. Oh. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. Hold on. No, I pulled out something. In the, in the, I, we had an echo going on. Every time I'd say something like this. Mm-hmm. 
it would come up. It would come up like five minutes later. I tell you something like this. Like I thought, say, hey, co-host, oh. hey, co-host. Hello, hello. <laughs> so we, we're in so a fat was, woman's vagina. Is that what was going on? Oh, <laughs> okay. All right, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. So where was I? Cameron Diaz has a yes. penis. Yes. Mm-hmm. No. Yes. So, uh, <clears throat> so no, they, they, they wake up in the morning. Holy moly. They got married. Holy mackerel. She's got a little plastic, <laughs> plastic ring on her finger. I've and, been bamboozled. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> when they go down to breakfast, they're like, all right, joke's over with. Let's get a divorce. Uh-huh. They get into an argument. Cameron Diaz makes some little smart ass comment. Here's a quarter for your troubles. Ashton Kutcher's like, fuck off. And then he turns around, just drops the quarter in the machine just for shits and giggles. Mm-hmm. And he's about to walk out until it lights up. And he's won the, until the uh, jackpot machine lights mm-hmm. up. He's won $3 million. Oh my God. Only in the wonderful world of movies. Now, of course, they got married. Legally, they got married. So you know when you get married and you ain't got no prenup. Yeah, you're screwed. The woman gets half. Oh, half your ass, half your crotch. Exactly. Oh. You might as well just chop off one butt cheek and <laughs> yeah, give it to her. Because that's jar, half your ass. Yeah. Hand it over to her. Yeah, put it in a uh, little drop of formaldehyde and give it to her because it's hers. Yeah, she'll but go dumbass. Cut one of your balls off and give it to her because that's what you got to do. Oh. So what I'm saying here is that half of that $3, $3 million is hers. Mm. Now they want to get a, of course they want to get a divorce right. and try to get this whole thing settled. They go to court. Dennis Miller, who's kind of he's actually pretty good in this movie, plays, Is a, he? He plays a judge named Judge Whopper, like the hamburger. Oh, give me yeah, a break. yeah, no. So he says, "Hey, you, you guys, I hate this generation." With your, your instant coffee, and your, 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 I want it now. This pop tarts and all Nintendos, that. Nintendos, your instant your candy oatmeal. whistles, yeah, and comic books. And he said, "You know what? You don't value marriage like I value my marriage when I got married. So you get six months hard marriage. What the hell? What and, is- and you got to go to marriage counseling. By the way, Queen Latifah is their marriage counselor. Oh, <laughs> I know. God, gets, this, this movie just sounds like it's getting better and better. It gets more bizarre, don't it? Oh, this is a bizarre world already. What are you talking about? <laughs> so, now, this is where the movie gets crazy for me. Mm-hmm. Now, first of all, Ain't no judge in the land going to have two people who got married in Vegas come to their court and going to make them stay married. Oh. Especially when, when this bitch comes in with a plastic ring on her finger shaped like dice. You ain't going to stay married. <laughs> yeah, no, <sure. laughs> it's stupid. <laughs> but it gets even crazier than that. So they're forced mm-hmm. to stay together. Yeah. They are going to get $1.5 million. I mean, after six months, they can get divorced and be millionaires. Yeah. Why they are fighting... I don't know because they spent a good 40 minutes of this movie being the most unlikable people in the world just bickering with each other. Uh, Let me tell you something. Tell me. For $50 and a hamburger, I would stay 12 months with a bitch and keep my mouth quiet. Oh, hell, I mean, for $10, I'll wipe her ass and be quiet. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, she can shit in the sink every day. <laughs> yes, she can. I'm going to be like, good morning. How are you? <laughs> you know, <laughs> I'll brush your teeth with it. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do that for five cents. Exactly. I mean, <laughs> I don't see what the problem is there. Now, all that aside, the movie does get really funny when Rob Cordry comes in, mm-hmm. who's the little prematurely bald buddy. Uh. And, and he's just hilarious, man. This guy just, I've seen him in a few movies yeah. and every movie that I've seen him in, he's been the bright spot. No, there's no difference here. Mm-hmm. And, Cameron Diaz, his friend Lake Bell. Mm-hmm. Uh, when those, when Rob Corddry and Lake Bell are fighting, mm-hmm. it's it's funny, man. Uh, hilarity ensues. So you telling me that the two people that they paid to be the names on the posters aren't funny? <laughs> well, later on in the movie, they 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 become more likable because they start to fall in love, and the movie does kind of end on a sweet note. So I I, I I fell for that. But no, I mean it, because hey, look, who are we talking about? We talking about Ashton Kutcher. Yeah, we're talking about two dumbasses. Yeah, I mean, because yeah. Ashton Kutcher, everything that that he has to say it, is it's common gold. Oh, no, hell no. <laughs> I mean, he's being he's being Ashton Kutcher. Right. She comes in. She's like, "Hi, hi. Uh, what do you mean by hi? Oh my god. Uh, hello. Uh, hi. I'm Ashton Kutcher. You need to take a page out of Jerry Lewis's book, there." <laughs> I mean, work and, on that. And second of all, can you imagine being married to Ashton Kutcher? Dumb. I mean, he he's no. sitting, man that you're just trying to live your life every day. And he's trying to punk your ass every turn you take. Shit. That that motherfucker will be dead before it's over with. That he wouldn't make six months. Oh uh, no, hell no, no. I'd get his ass drunk, throw him out one of them Vegas windows, and say, hey. <laughs> He got fucked up. What do you want me to do about it? Hey, <laughs> what you say? He wouldn't even. I make- was trying to pick up hookers. I don't know what he was doing up here. He, <laughs> he got wild and crazy. He punked himself. <laughs> what you say? He wouldn't even make it out of Vegas. Huh? Hell no. 
<laughs> no, it's, so I can't even imagine them being married. I'm I'm more sympathetic to Cameron Diaz than the Ashton Kutcher in this. <laughs> I mean, because mostly guys, and that's the thing. Yeah. It, it looks like a chick flick, mm-hmm. and I would I would say it's just a straight up comedy mm-hmm. because guys can kind of relate to Ashton Kutcher having to deal. Oh, with really? This girl. Being good looking and yeah, dating Demi Moore and yeah, just being a all around cool guy in Hollywood. I'm sure they can relate to him. Okay, it takes a little bit of suspension of disbelief. Oh, a lot of, <laughs> but, a, a lot of the the disbelief. <laughs> <laughs> but it's it, no, it, it it's not a great movie. I could easily watch this on TV or DVD. I don't have to go see this at the movie. I mean, mm. if you go see this at the movie, chances are you're gonna be punked out your eight fifty, right? Uh, whatever it is you got. So yuck, I, yuck. So yeah, you, you like that? <laughs> yeah, I like it. I stole that from you, by the way. What the hell is that? What am I in the Twilight Zone? <laughs> Where you getting calls from? Uh, no one. What you got a transmitter building? You ain't. I didn't know you had. I had a phone in you. Uh, I got a lot of things in me. Uh, a heart, a heart of gold. Uh, Damn! I just bought an iPhone. I could have used you instead. <laughs> Carry your big oh, ass head around. That's all right. I don't need to be anywhere near you, pal. <laughs> could have carried. I don't your, do that. Your big ass head around everywhere, <laughs> save some dollars. But anyway, so no, I would. Uh, I'd, I'd give this sort of a mid range, mid range rental. It's, Mid-range, huh? Yeah, yeah. It's mm. not. It wasn't as terrible as I thought it was going to be. Okay. All right. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, yeah. That's why I recognize you from. Man, you used to work in Vegas, didn't you? What? Yeah, you used to be one of those me? slot machines there. Hell no! You, you never seen me at Vegas. Never heard of the place. Don't know what you're talking about. You're crazy. You're talking crazy. Man, you don't know me. You don't know nothing about me. <laughs> that's perfect. No, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, I love these audios because I know that people yeah. are wondering what the hell are we doing half yeah. the time <laughs> until they see the videos. Make it magic. <laughs> yeah, that's right, people. Don't worry about it. We know what we're doing. We're professionals work. here. Professionals. Let us do our thing. <laughs>